few Canada Games builders have had as much of an impact in shaping the Canada Games as Peter Lezo. À titre de sous-ministre adjoint du sport pour le gouvernement fédéral de 1977 à 1986, Peter Lezo est à l'origine de nombreuses politiques et procédures des Jeux du Canada. His work on policies and procedures helped shape the way the games are structured today. Nowadays, regulations such as doping controls have become a norm throughout amateur and professional sports. However, Lizou is credited with taking the initiative to enforce the regulations within amateur sport organizations that compete in the Canada Games. Lizou a grandement contribué à l'augmentation de la participation des femmes aux Jeux du Canada. Ensuring that the male-female ratio was more balanced allowed for increased participation among the female athletes. Malgré un grand écart entre la participation des hommes et des femmes dans le sport, Peter Lezo a insisté sur l'importance d'augmenter le ratio des femmes. Although a more positive ratio received some resistance, it was eventually passed, and Canada's female athletes have reaped the benefits ever since. Lezo a également défendu l'importance du bilinguisme aux Jeux du Canada. To this day, the importance of bilingualism as a practice is stressed throughout all levels of Canada Games delivery. With the 2013 Canada Games being held here in Sherbrooke this year, it is the perfect opportunity to showcase the strides that the Council and the Games themselves have taken to ensure Canada's two official languages are properly represented. Doping controls, increased female athlete participation, bilingualism, coaching certification and cultural events have helped the Canada Games grow substantially throughout the years. These initiatives fundamental ont permis aux Jeux du Canada d'atteindre les envergures actuelles. Pour sa contribution exceptionnelle à l'avancement des Jeux du Canada, Peter Lezo mérite amplement d'être intronisé au Hall d'honneur des Jeux du Canada.